In this video, I'm going to show you how you can quickly change where the address bar is in Safari on the iPhone. If you've updated to iOS 15, you may have noticed that the address bar, where you type in the address, the web address, is now located at the bottom. Well, you can move that back to the top. Let's see how we do this. Let's go to my iPhone. So I'm looking at my iPhone here, and if we look, you're going to see I have my address bar down here at the bottom. By default, when you upgrade to iOS 15 on the iPhone, it moves this address bar to the bottom where it used to be located at the top here. Now before I show you how you can easily move that back to the top, what I would do is I would try it out at the bottom here for a little bit. The reason why Apple moved it down to the bottom here is because it makes it easier to reach when you're holding your phone with one hand. This really comes in handy when you have one of the larger iPhones. I just tap in here with my thumb, and now I can type in a new address. The address bar is located just above my keyboard, so it makes it really easy to type something in. Also, what you can do is you can easily switch between, I'm going to cancel here, you can easily switch between different tabs. I have a few different tabs here. You're going to see I have a little tab peeking out over here on the right. All I have to do is just swipe to the left on this address bar. I just swipe to the left, and I'm looking at another page. I swipe to the left again. I'm looking at a different page. I want to go back to my site. I just swipe two times to the right, and I'm back at my site. So having this address bar at the bottom really can make the iPhone easier to use, but it is going to be an adjustment. But if you did want to move it back to the top, all you have to do is just tap on the double A's here. When I tap on it, I have a menu that pops up. And one of the options here is show top address bar. You do not have to go into the settings app. That is another way of doing this, going into the settings app and then going to Safari. But instead of doing that, you just tap on this. And now we can see we have my address bar back at the top. Now when it is at the top, I am not going to be able to swipe to my different tabs. I'm going to swipe to the left. You're going to see it doesn't do anything. How do I get to my other windows? I have to tap on the two squares here, and I can get to the other windows or the other tabs. If I move it back down to the bottom, again, all you have to do is just tap on the double A's, and then tap on Show Bottom Bar. When you do that, to move back and forth between your different pages, you just have to swipe to the left or right. So that's how you can easily move the address bar in Safari on the iPhone from the bottom to the top of the iPhone. By default, when you upgrade to iOS 15, it moves it to the bottom. There are some distinct advantages to this. It's within easy reach, and to move to a different page, you just have to swipe back and forth or swipe to the left or right. If you do want to move it back to the top like it was in previous versions of iOS, all you have to do is just tap on the double A's, a menu will pop up, and from there you can move it to the top. If you want to move it back down to the bottom to give it another shot, you tap on the double A's again, and then you can move it back down to the bottom. So that's how you can easily move the address bar in Safari on the iPhone. 